This is BBC Two, the place where quiz heads and bungalow heads meet. With a brand new twist on an old favourite, it's Dick and Dom's Ask the Family. Says he hates ghosts. Ha! See through meddlers, wandering around the night time, rubbish, white faces, nonsense! This is the Lewis family from Bristol. Here's Ali. She has a crush on Dom. Ha! She must be deranged. He's a given! Ha ha! Awful! <laughs> Question one. In the UK, which hard Italian cheese is typically grated onto pasta dishes? Lewis. Lewis's. Parmesan. Oh. Hang on, just a, just a quick tip here. Uh, press the button then answer. I did. What? I did. You did it at the same I time, did. woman. Not, not going to mention it. You've just started. I think we've got a mad one there. Yes, I think we have. <laughs> All right. This question is for the little people only. What is the name of the American Secretary of State? Is it Bonda Giza Noodle or Condo Lisa Rice? Pasta. Bonza Coodle Needle. <laughs> <laughs> you are a silly ass! Oh, yes, you're a silly ass. Put your ass mask on, Sam. Go on, put it on your little face. Make yourself look like a donkey. Hee haw! Ha rubbish! <laughs> the answer, Sam, was Condo Lisa Rice. You silly ass. <laughs> silly ass. This question is for the blokes only. You're the guys with. Well, you know who we are. Okay. Um, according to the famous uh, self help book, what planet are women supposed to be from? Arsenal. Yes. Venus. Uh, yes. yes. Although uh, some people say they're from Uranus. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Which of these is the real title of somebody who works for the Queen? The Master of the Horse or the Mistress of the Muse? <laughs> yes, Mistress Lewis. of the Muse. Mistress, no, 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 it's no, not. It's Master, Master of the Muse. Let's try anyway. The, uh, the next is D-O-M. Dom, our international uh, car registration of which country? Personal. Yes. Birds. Dominican Republic. You're right. Yeah. This question is for the little people only. Which Chinese New Year began in 2005? The year of the rooster or the year of the badger? Oh. Lewis's. Year of the rooster. It was yes, the year of the rooster. rooster. Which American hip hop star has a stage name which stands for Ladies Love Cool James? Which American hip hop star has a stage name which stands for Birds. Birds. El How Cool J. A what? El Cool J. L Cool J. We'll give you that. Yeah, yeah. L Cool J. L. <laughs> Ladies. I think that's cruelty to animals having him on that team. Silly ass. Put your silly mascot ass on as well for being for criticising another silly ass. Your pair of silly asses. Uh, Thank you. That, that shut her up. Uh, listen to this song and give us the title of the film that made it famous. Oh, oh, Burns. Jungle Book. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Oh dear, more of the same rubbish at the end of that twaddle. The Burns are in the lead with 60 and the Lewis's only have 20. Ha <laughs> ha, awful. <laughs> okay, over here, it's the lovely, luscious Lewis family. It's when who everyone is? Uh, Ali. Oh uh, yeah, but who is she? Uh, she? She's my mum. All right, yep, fair enough. Who's she? <laughs> he doesn't know either! <laughs> um, Come on, what have we got here? She's She's what? A very close friend. Oh, oh is she? Very no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is she your, is she your girlfriend? <laughs> and now on Ask the Family, it's a wedding. Please welcome the world. Stand up, stand up. There you are. Stand up, come on, stand up. Can we have some wedding music? We've got a ring, oh, We've got a ring yeah. here. It's the wedding of Isaac and Alice. So will you, Isaac, take Alice to be your awful wedded wife? No. No, right. And will you, will you, Alice, take uh, Isaac to be your awful wedded husband? All right, fair enough. <laughs> That's that. Uh, now then, I've been reading my biox. Can, can I share your... Yes, uh, please do. Thank housewife's you. housewife's favourite... Now, I've been Dominic. reading your bio, and it says... <laughs> May I call you Dom? May I call you Dom? Of course you can. May I remove your glasses? Yes. That says something about you. Oh, no, you can't see. I bet not. And uh, what does it say on the bio? I'm sorry? What does it say on your bio? 
and says you're a little bit of a dummy fan. Yeah, I, is that right? I like you, Dom. Problem is, Dom, right? I like Dom. Karen likes you too, don't you, Karen? What? Oh, Karen, no go, way. Go, oh, go, oh, go, great. Go and share the oh, hang on, they've got a minute for me. Oh, what are you doing? Get up, What's going on? Oh, it's you, you want, lady. Come on, fuck it. Look at that. This is just fantastic. I'm making this up by some of the women. Put me down. Put me down. The mummies love him. Thank you very much, families. Right, yeah, there we are. Big both families, everyone. Here we Birthday. It's a gritty radio drama made for schools with terrible acting throughout. Have a listen. I don't think your shoebox is magic, Danny McNamara. It is a magic shoebox, it is, it is. See, if I rub it, I can make things appear. See, see? <laughs> yeah, alright, Danny, quite magic. Got anything else? If I rub it again, it'll make me... Oh, I see your point. That is a magic shoebox. You better hand it over, McNamara. No, get off, get off. It's my shoebox and you'll never have it. Ow, ow, get off. You're hurting my feelings. I'll rub it again and zoom off. You'll see. <laughs> what a lovely story, eh? But what was the first sound? Without looking at my card. Lion. Lion. Tiger. Tiger, lion. Tiger, tiger lion. No. <laughs> what? A tiger lion. A tiger lion? It no, wasn't a tiger lion. No, you're wrong. It's a leopard. There you are. Uh, <laughs> second sound? I didn't know that. I didn't. Not a clue. Uh, have a guess. Go on. Um, toothbrush. Toothbrush? Very close. No, have another listen. It's a steam iron. <laughs> a steam close iron. Close. Obviously, yeah. And thirdly? A plane. Yeah, I think we'll give you half the points, Val. We'll give you five for that, because it was actually Concord. <laughs> not bad, Burns, not bad. Five points for the Burns. La, 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 lovely Lewis's. Here are your three sound effects in a story. Even in all, it's a hard-hitting police radio drama from the 1940s. Even, sir. <laughs> Been out partying, have we? Oh, we're a proper little clever clogs, aren't we, sir? <laughs> Oi, come back here. I'll call the RSPCA on you, so I will, and that and all, and like the Queen is my witness, we'll pretend your pounds look after themselves. Nate, Nate. Lewis, <laughs> you heard three sound effects there. <laughs> um, what were they? Um, Bedtime in our house. No, monkeys. Yes. Monkeys. <laughs> monkeys. A what? Monkeys. Bedtime in our Bedtime house. Bedtime in your house. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the monkeys. Monkeys Bad are boys. well, actually, it's chimps and chimps are apes. But uh, apes That's monkeys. That's what similar. I was going to say. Was it? <laughs> yeah. yeah, that is okay. I'll give you that one. Okay. What was the second one? Uh, motorcycle. A motorcycle. Is that all of your final answers? Yeah. Yeah. It was actually very close. It was just like a motorcycle. It's actually moped. A moped. No, it's cooking popcorn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's what I was just going about to say. Oh, of course. <laughs> all right. And uh, then the third and last one. What was that? Uh, an aerosol can. Uh, is that what you all think? What's an aerosol can? Or a What's an aerosol can? Hose of air. It's like uh, a tire ball. hose. Oh, an aerosol. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. <laughs> Thingy. No, it was, in fact, it was a steam train. <laughs> How are you to get one to the Lewis's? Get ten points! Yeah. <laughs> ah, look at that, look at that, look at that! The ladies are here. With the picture board behind this cloth are five pictures uh, which make up the name of a famous person or famous place. Uh, Burns, you will go first. You'll get ten points if you're right. Ladies, whip it up! Lovely. There you go. Who or what is that, Burns? We'll give you a clue. It's actually a person. Billy Bob Thornton. Oh, yeah. That's right. Right. Lining it. Go on, Ed. Ten points for the Burns. Right, lining. There we go. We're going to pass it straight over to the next team. The Lewis is. Can we spin it, please, women? <laughs> what, 
it. What did you say? They're lovely ladies. Yeah. <laughs> oh, lovely. No, with it. No. <laughs> no, stop it. Okay, carry on. <laughs> All right. No, just a million thoughts, one show. Okay. Uh, okay. What do you? What's Barbara that? Wilson. It's, it's a place. Uh, it's, it's a person. What's that? Barbara. Barbara. Barbara Windsor. Yeah! Barbara Windsor. There you go. There you are. Ten points to both teams. Good yeah. round. Really yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> OK, then. Lewis is. Yes, Dom. Hello. <laughs> uh, now, then, you've got a certain job, haven't you? Yes, Dom. Will you stop it? Jesus. OK, well, what's your job? I'm a midwife. Oh, how yes. lovely. Now, you've seen many children born and yes, lots of mess Dom. and slop that comes after it. Yes. Uh, but there's a very sweet story about you and William. What's the connection? Yes. What's the lovely story? It's lovely because mm. I delivered all his babies and I and I we um we slept together after Alice was born. You <laughs> <laughs> couldn't get home. You couldn't get home. You mean in a mutual friendship kind of way? Yeah. yeah. Good. He, right. He Lovely. Was well I bet shut up woman. Uh, I bet you <laughs> Me. Shut up. Uh, I bet in your whole time as a uh, midwife, you've never seen a child look like this before. <laughs> look at it. It's a celebrity baby from oh. hell. Two celebrities have got together and produced that. Oh. Teams, you have to buzz in when you think you know which celebrities have made that baby. <laughs> Prince Charles and Alan Partridge. No, no, you got one of them right. Keep going. Is it a man and a woman? No, no, we'll have to give it. We'll have to give we'll it to the Burns. You've got to go, Lewis's Burns. Any ideas? Uh, no. We know what Prince, Prince Charles. Charles. Yeah, you got Prince Charles? Yeah, that's already. Yeah. Margaret no. Thatcher. Margaret Thatcher. It wasn't. We'll tell you that. It was Matt Lucas and Prince Charles. <laughs> but we'll give the Lewis's five points because they didn't get Prince Charles. <laughs> uh, we've got another baby. Uh, two people have got together and made a beautiful child. Look at it. From hell. Look at that. Ooh. <laughs> oh, Burns. I've got him straight away. Who is it? Prince William. Who? Prince William. No. No, you yeah, haven't got any of them, right? So over the losers. Right, think carefully, wait. Think carefully. The music wasn't a clue. Oh. Uh, so you've uh, now got all the time in the world. Well, oh, okay. not that long. We've had some good ones. <laughs> 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 losers, any ideas whatsoever? I think no. Jeremy Paxman. Any, ah, you got that right. <laughs> I now. ran over Jeremy Paxman's foot once when I was cycling up Endell Street. you got some funny chat up lines, <laughs> you have, haven't you? <laughs> So, Jerry Paxton will give you five for that. Do you know who the other person is? Which other celebrity made that baba? Anne Robinson or something. No, Robinson. no. We'll have to give you the answer. We're giving you five points for Jerry Paxton. It was actually Natasha Kaplinsky Plonsky Pluska. And there you are. And if you can see, yes, Natasha and Jeremy got together and made that. It looks like something of Plants the Apes. All right then, okay. Right. Now, uh, the next round is the uh, close up round, and uh, we're going to give you an example. Don't buzz in because this is j just purely so you get the idea of the game. We're going to show you a close up of something, and then uh, you're going to guess what it is. So, for example, you see something like this. This. Now, you're gonna, you're you might guess what it is. You might think that that's someone's watch, but it's actually not because it's actually Dom's mate, Pat. <laughs> okay, that was an example, but here come the real things. It's a buzz around. The first people to get it right will get 10 points. Here's the first close up of the object. What do you think that is? The buzz if you think you know. Mm. Oh, 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 the birds. The broom. Mm. Not so a broom. So close, yeah. but not. That means Brush. birds you can't, you can't oh. answer any more losers. It's all down to you guys. Can we just let it come? Just let it come. We'll have him all. Let it come. Is it Lewis's? Feather duster. It is a feather duster. Yeah. Yeah. Well done. Ten points for Lewis's. There's the feather duster. Pink, yellow, and blue. Fluffy, fluffy, fluffy. Blue flag. Here we go, next one coming your way. Here's the close up object. See if you can guess what it is. First one to buzz gets 10 points. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> do it. Be careful. Go on then, what do you think? Don't let your mother answer. Go on, Alice. I don't know. What do you mean you don't want to hear your buzz? buzz? What is it? Are you. Do you, do you, you what can do you say it. it. Go on, say it. What do you think it is? It's someone's. <laughs> uh, someone's <laughs> what? <laughs> What's wrong? Someone's bum. Bum. So, someone's bum? <laughs> well, I can tell you now, could I have a drum roll? Here you are! Wrong. Over to the other team. Bird. Is what? it a peach? Yeah. A peach no, you're wrong as well. Sorry about that. None of you got it right. It's actually... Well, let's have a look. Here's an elbow! Oh. <laughs> oh. There you go. If you do that, actually, uh, that's an elbow. Oh, here are the scores. Super Speedy Burns have got 75, and the little slow milk flow Lewis's, they've got 60. <laughs> oh. Dreadful. <laughs> no, look. 
Piggy Carroll. Ah, yeah. Hi, fellas. Now, listen, I'm having a showbiz party. All the big stars are coming. Uh, Gareth Gates, Michelle McMammoth, yeah. Basil Brush, C-3PO. I'd love you to come over, but uh, unfortunately, you're not quite famous enough yet. So, uh, what, 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 are you, what are you eating? Sausage. Uh. <laughs> no, 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 it's all right. What? It's all right. It's not a vegetarian. It's a vegetarian sausage. Oh, oh well, that, that's, that's just fine. No, hang on. What? No, it is pork sausage. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh, the burns, the burns. Karen, mm. you're not as mad as her over there, are you? No, I'm not. You're a nice mummy. Quite yeah, you're a good mummy. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> just two seconds. <clears throat> no, no, please don't. No, no, no. Please. Sam. No, don't. Would you, uh, no, 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 would no. Would you uh, care no. to explain that? Um, <laughs> what? It's uh, my is nieces. That? It's your what? My nieces. Right, Mickey, explain that. That is Sam's rabbit. That's my yeah. nieces. And um, what does he use that for? Cuddling. Right. No, cousins. <laughs> you have a cuddly rabbit. Look at it, look at his cuddly rabbit. It looks cuddly, look at it. A real cuddly rabbit, that. And, uh, when you get home from school, yeah. you like to sniff it, don't you? No. Nope. <laughs> it's the first thing you do when you come in from the door from school, isn't it? No. Nope. Funny, when, when, when Rich used to come home from school, the first thing he ever sniffed was his... It was his, his, his cuddly uh, toy chicken. It was very sweet. <laughs> which is uh, with the, uh, the Lewis's. Right, so come over here. Now, William. William, 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 William. Um, now, I'm going to let everyone know about TV Secret here. We have makeup. Yes, we do, to make us look even more beautiful than we are. I know it's difficult to understand, but it is. It's true. And uh, we were all in makeup earlier, and we went out. And before we went out, I said, Good luck, everyone. Hope you have a really good show. There we are with my earpiece in and my microphone. Right, see you later. Bye, bye, bye. And when I walked out, you said something to everyone. What did you say? Who was that? Yeah. <laughs> Who was that? What did you think I was? Some kind of tea boy? Wish you everyone good luck. Uh, yes, my name's Dom. Lovely to meet you. Lovely and now you're going to play the next round, so step over here, because there's two lovely ladies waiting for you. And Ed Byrne, if you'd like to come up as well, because underneath these cloths on these trays are lots of different objects. You've got 30 seconds in which to remember as many objects as you can, and then we'll ask you after, and the person that can remember the most items will get 10 points. Now, uh, obviously you've got lovely ladies here trying to put you off. <laughs> and don't dribble, because we'll have a dribbly Ed and a dribbly Willy. Right, OK. So, <laughs> Whip the cloth off! Your 30 seconds starts now! No. Oh no, it's cool! Come on, oh dear, oh no! Oh, there. Remember the items, Ed? Come on, that's it! No looking! Oh dear, oh! He's taking his glasses off! Oh no! Look at that! Oh. <laughs> yes, that's, that's that, yes, Ed. Oh, lovely! <laughs> Concentrate. Concentrate. Can we have a go after? <laughs> <laughs> right, turn right, stop, stop. I think, we sh I think we should have a go now. Come on, let's have a go. Come on, no, no, no. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. We're going to cover the trays quick because they shouldn't have any okay. more time. Oh. They, are they are cheating now. There we are. Right, over the reds. Hey, right, walk off. Thank you very Thank much. You very there much. you go. <laughs> no, Ed, back here. Oi, Ed. Later, please! You bad man. Sorry. Right then, you guys. You've got to try and remember as many items as you can. You can't repeat items. So if you say one thing and he says exactly the same, it's all over Ed wins. Right then, Ed, you're going first. Give us an item. Uh, fried egg. Yes. Scrubbing brush. Yes. Uh, tape measure. Mm hmm Gun. Uh, yes. Globe. Pardon? <laughs> yes. Globe. Globe, Globe, yes. Globe. <laughs> Globe. <laughs> CD. CD, yes. CD. Uh, some cotton. Mm, yes. An expanding ruler. Expanding ruler. Expanding ruler. What's, expand what's an expanding ruler? Uh, I think you call them tape measures. Ah, oh, no, like, Ed's already said no. that. Ed's already said that's so the Ed. You won, mate. You get ten points. <laughs> ten points. <laughs> oh, it's oh, 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 William, William. You get the booby prize, which is an all-expenses trip with those two girls to Belgium. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like Belgium, oh, 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 oh. Alright, I guess that trip's cancelled then. Let's find out what the scores are so far. <laughs> Uh, uh, excuse me, excuse me, TV's Dominic Word. Hey? You are set on me, oh. and Richard McCourt is also set uh, on me. Uh, uh, it's Tiddler! Tiddler! Oh. I feel better now. You literally were cramping my hairstyle. <laughs> it's okay now, though. I look groovy. <laughs> <laughs> right then. <laughs> so, so you're here? Yes. And uh, you're ready to do the next round? Which I is am. called? 
uh, place again, Robert, <laughs> because I'm an expert, ladies and gentlemen, families and audience. Ooh, they're a lovely lot. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm here because I'm an expert in Aster Family. I know everything you must know about the old Aster Family, and I've brought you some questions from the old programme to see if you can answer them. It really is that simple. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, then, so we can take it one at a time. Um, Burns first. Have a look at your clip, and then uh, just tell us the answer afterwards. Here comes some more music. Here it is. We want muffin from you. Now everybody sing it with me and we may see muffin. Are you ready? Yeah. We want muffin, muffin from you. I may say if everyone had joined in, I would have evacuated the studio <laughs> upon the instant. Um, all I want to know is in which year did Muffin the Mule make his final appearance on television? So, Burns, it's all down to you now. That was, uh, that was kids' TV, by the way, before Dick and Dom in the bungalow. Yes, well, it was proper. Yeah. And ordinary. How do they make the horsey dance? How do you make the horsey dance? <laughs> yeah. There's lots of magic twinkly dust. Mm. In which Good year on. did Muffin the Mule <laughs> make his final appearance on television? 1967. You go for 1967. Let's see if you're right. 1960. No. 56. 56 is the answer. <laughs> you missed it by one. You yeah. missed it by ten. It's 1957. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, oh. Burns. All right then. Over to you, Lewis's. L -l 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 Lovely Lewis's. Uh, here's your clip. Have a look at this, will you, please? Uh, you drop the shapes into the little boxes below, and you get a word. It's a toughie. What, what's the word? <laughs> that's, the, that's the noise I make when things are a little bit tricky. It's also a noise that an owl makes at night when it's trying to eat. Well, observe. Tolerate. Tolerate. Tolerate, Tolerate what? Tolerate. Tolerate. Oh, it's the, the word. word. Is it? Uh, let's see if you're right. Yeah. Illiterate. Illiterate, yes. Let's see it happen. There you have it. Fits as perfectly as you We got the last bit right. You what? The what? rate. Eight. Uh, rate. <laughs> uh, rate. Well, uh, well done, but not well done, because you didn't get it right. Never mind. Uh, so, no points for you on that round. Loser! What? Loser! Bye-bye! <laughs> 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 They've changed from white into black outfits. Got any plans up your sleeve today, mate? I have. Get a date. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So, um, I will woo her with my magical power. Oh, yes. <laughs> Hi. Um. Oh! oh hey! Oh. Okay. Uh, pack of cards. Pack of cards. Ooh. Oh! oh. I've got 52 cards in the pack. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to offer you a card. Then you can... Here come Sam and Vicky, you're playing this game. It's a height order game. We have uh, four pictures here which you've got to put into height order. Tallest first, smallest last. Ready? Off you go. Have a good look. I'll tell you who you've got. You've got Chewbacca, Star Wars, David James, Ricky Inglesias, and Ed. Who's the tallest? Who's the smallest? Um, right, go on. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. A very wonderful comedy impression that you've been as well. Yeah. Not only a magician, an impersonator too. Okay, great. Think you done? Yeah. Okay, take a step back. Let me tell you if you're right. <sighs> you're wrong. Uh, but you did get Chewbacca right. Here's the uh, tallest there, seven foot three inches. It's actor Peter Mayhew, of course, Chewbacca. Uh, David James was supposed to be next, six foot five. Then Enrique Iglesias, six foot two, and then it was supposed to be Ed at the end. He's only six and a half. So you get foot. one point then. You don't get. Him. You get out. <laughs> you got it wrong. Oh, no. You grovelling to me? Yeah. yeah. What am I getting your points for? For getting got one right. a bit of it right? Because you think we're lovely. We're kids, come on. We didn't get one right. Do you want to think they're lovely? Ask the audience. This is a new one to be admitted. Just turn into a flipping pantomime now. Can you see Chris Tarrant round here anywhere? No. no. Right. Sit down. Sit down. <laughs> anyway, as I was, 
I have the pack of cards. <laughs> and now what I can do is... <laughs> Right, okay. Destined not to do any magic. Lewis is uh, Alison Isaac. Get your bums up here. Hey, wait a minute. That's nice. There he is. Uh, <laughs> I don't like this. It's your fat head. There we are. Okay, so you've got to start with the tallest first and make it go to the smallest. Fat head, fat head, fat head. Shut up. Go. <laughs> Come on. The first one over here, the one you're touching is Kylie Minogue. And you've got Jimmy Cranky as well. Will mean nothing to you, but hilarious for us. <laughs> uh, over there, it's Ali. Who's Ali? Uh, uh, and Dominic Wood, housewife's favourite. <laughs> Short, fat, little hairy man. Are we going from small? Can't talk about Jimmy Cranky like that. Are we going from small? Tallest first. Uh, tall. As I yeah, tall. You tell him, Isaac. Tallest first. Yes. Born, oh. Isaac. Tell her. Shut up, boy. Yes. Oh. Oh. Shut up, please. You're not going to help, otherwise you're going to chuck you out. <laughs> You want it? Yeah? Is that it? Right, that's oh, it. Take oh, shut up. Come take stand here. Side. Obviously, you've got no idea who any of them are, because uh, there uh, you've got this one, because that's probably one of the smallest. In fact, let's just move that one over here. Carly fits nicely there, and that's actually the right way around. Ali's the tallest at 5'6". Uh, little Woody over there. He's 5'4". Uh, 5'1 five five uh, five for Carly Minogue, and Jimmy Cranky is an amazing 4'5". <laughs> Careful of the beast talk. <laughs> you just pointed at your own head then, and pointed and said Little Willy. Woody. Oh, Woody. You said Willy. <laughs> Did I? Yeah. Well, <laughs> right, off you go. Then. <laughs> oh, it's turning into a carry-on film. Yeah, hey, isn't it, Josh? Would you like another sausage? <laughs> Oh, as we go to the final round, Mr. Dick, Lewis are on 60, Burns are on 85, ha <laughs> ha, dreadful a lot of them, ha <laughs> yeah. All right, then, the final round is, have your cake and eat... He can't add up. What? He can't add up. Oh, you pipe down, woman, we're trying to get to the end of this flipping show. Pipe down, you boiler. Ha ha, ha on a place, Thank right you. Then. Okay, you've got some quick five questions, you have to answer them when you get a question right. You have to pick up a cake and stick it in your gob, you have to eat it. The one who eats the most amount of cake after this noise... <laughs> ...will be the winner of the game. <laughs> They'll be the winner of the whole show. The winner of Ask the Family, basically the family that eat the most cake. Ready? Look. What? they got more we cake. Got more... The reason why you've got more cake is because you're losing at the moment. So you get an extra slice. More cake to eat. But if you eat it all before the burns, you'll win. All right, go! How many children does a woman give birth to if she has quintuplets? Five. Lewis, five. Ali, you should have known that, you're right. Can we right. Eat cake now? Uh, yeah, just give everyone this cake and eat it. Oh, right. see, this is, here we go. Uh, oh, oh. My oh. first ghetto is named after an area in which country? Yeah. Germany. Germany it is. Uh, this is a question for the little people. Which weekday BBC News programme is presented by Ellie Rachel and Lisa Muzimba? <laughs> oh, News Round. Burn News Round. Burn, yeah, burn News Round, why shouldn't we? Which MP is the winner of two Oscars? Lucy. Glenda Jackson. Yeah, it is. Well, that eat a piece of cake. <laughs> Which type of cake is known for having two little people on top? <laughs> yeah. Winning cake. Correct. Wedding cake. Eat some more cake. Which Andrew Lloyd Webber musical features the song Memory? Oh, <laughs> just cake it is the cat. Back of my Get head. some more cake down your necks. Uh, which French queen is famous for having said, let them eat cake, Lewis's? Marie Antoinette. Marie, yes, it is. Stop what you're doing. Hands up. And if we have a good look, we have a good look. The birds have won! <laughs> I'm not going over towards you. You're, this is your this is your play. Here we are, Mammy. Aren't we pleased you won? Uh, Ali. <laughs> Lovely composed bird. That's yours. You are the winner. No, uh, you are the winners. Hang on a minute. No, no. Elizabeth <laughs> Hamilton. Oh, get her off me! Oh, hey. Get her off me! She's absolutely nuts! Finish this, you show on your own. Bye! The Burns, you're the winners of Aston Family, you get a plate with winner on it! Yeah. Yeah. On today's DVD extras, take a look at Wooden McCourt's official joke invigilator. Every joke that appears on the show is tested by this lady here for laughability, chortle worthiness, and humorosity. As we see, she's no pushover. The last time joke lady laughed was in 1845. Good luck, guys. You're gonna need it. <laughs>